I've been shagging and bragging, it's been a lot of fun. The Jenkins Orphanage. Um, the Jenkins Orphanage uh, w was founded by Daniel Jenkins, 1895. He is a reverend, he was a businessman, and he was a musician. And he never thought these things would come together, but he's walking home from a parishioner's uh, house one night, and, and he's, he's crossing the uh, railroad tracks, and there's a boxcar, and he hears a noise, which scares him at first, but he finds that there are five little kids huddled in it, trying to get some sleep, and they've been abandoned. Uh, he starts an orphanage, and uh, just took this picture, this is on uh, Franklin Street, this is, uh, and it's actually the Charleston uh, Housing Authority. Now, now they would march up and down the streets, he was, a, he was a charming guy, and so he would get instruments, he would get citadel uniforms, he would, uh, he would, he would do all sorts of uh, things that he could to keep the kids busy. Um, and they got so good that within 10 years, they played in the inaugural parades of Taft and Teddy Roosevelt in 1905. Now, many musicians came out of the Jenkins Orphanage. Uh, two of the most famous would have been Jabbo Smith and William Cat Anderson. And they, uh, they went on to play for, and this is in the, you know, you gotta think this is the 30s and 40s, so this is the big band era. Uh, there's still segregation, so if you were white, you went and played for somebody like Lawrence Welk. If you were black, then you sounded good. <laughs> Y'all didn't have the bubbles, though. We, you know, wow. Y'all had the champagne bottle. <laughs> this is Charleston style. Um, <laughs> but it was like, it, but they, you know, Duke Ellington, Count Basie, Cab Calloway. Um, Freddie Green was a kid that uh, lived nearby. So Freddie Green um, became the, the guitar player for Count Basie. And the way he did it was he was a kid and the, 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 um, he would see the kids marching up and down the street to play. And the kids would just play for tips so they could feed themselves that week. And he really wanted to be a part of the band. And so he's asking his parents, why can't I be in the band? And he said, you know, delicately, they were like, his dad and mom were, yeah, well, you have to live in the orphanage. And he starts screaming and crying, why can't I live in the orphanage? <laughs> so his dad went down and said, please, please you got to let my kid play. <laughs> you got to let my kid. So, so he did, and he did. My favorite, though, is Rufus Speedy Jones. Um, Rufus Speedy Jones was a trumpet player until he was 13 years old. And the drummer in the Jenkins Orphanage got adopted. So they moved Rufus to drums, and he had never touched drumsticks till he was 13 years old, and he became the drummer for uh, Duke Ellington. He also was the first drummer to invent the double bass drum. So, yeah. <laughs> so, so if you have, if you get, that's where you can put both you know, get both feet going, and you can move your left foot to a hi hat when you need. So, so if you're ever at a concert and you see, a, you know, you're at a band or at a festival or something like that, and you see a drummer with two bass drums, then you know he's really good. <laughs> Robert only has one. <laughs> you have to make yeah, I'm sorry. But what's cool is that this drum set, four years ago, four years ago, this drum set was actually up for auction. Um, and so this is the actual one Rufus Petey Jones played at auction and, um, and the original double bass drum. And someone's, someone's wife wouldn't let him buy it. Someone's, Somebody's someone. wife made all the money. This is why no one likes you. This is why. They, they would march up and down the streets, playing for tips for, move, uh, for, um, for food for the week. They would play standards like this. I want a two, I want two to swing low. Yes, we cherry up. 
coming for to carry me home. Yes, we know. Say, oh, sweet cherry, coming for to carry me home. Yeah, I looked over Jordan. What did I see? Coming for to carry me home. Yes, the band of angels. Saints go marching in. Oh, when the saints go marching in, well, Lord, I want to be a kind of When the saints go marching in, trouble. What I was doing. 